All right, so I am a connoisseur of steak sauces. Sometimes good ones, sometimes bad ones, but I kind of like this one. This one's different. It's new. I just came across it. It's new to me, I should say. I just came across it. Never had it before, but it's Peter Luger's Steakhouse Old Fashioned Sauce. Now, I'm used to brown sauces, uh, HP sauce, A1. I really like Heinz 57. This is completely different. This is kind of a tomato-based tomato based steak sauce and it's pretty thin it's got 30 calories per tablespoon zero fat in here some sodium seven grams of carbs per serving yeah it's different i'm gonna put some on my steaks and air fry it and see what happens no one ever said there goes randy the best there ever was at air frying so no idea how this is gonna turn out i'll let you know all right so let's see what this looks like I actually poured on the steak and i'll show you how thin this is Try not to overdo it. It's thin. It comes out fast. Depends on how much you like. And there it is. You can see how thin it is. It is not a thick sauce. It is not a brown sauce. A little taste test here. It has an interesting, unique flavor. It's unique to anything I've ever had. I've always been a brown sauce guy. This is not a brown sauce. It's more of a... It has a kind of a weird cocktail sauce taste to it. Maybe some vinegar, some tomato products in there. But it's different. It's unique. And I'm definitely going to try it out again because I just like the variety of having different steak sauces. So check it out. Peter Luger, Steakhouse Old Fashioned Sauce.